The funny, quirky fun of Ed DeBebix is back. Everything tastes as good as it looks over here, folks. Yeah, that's what I thought. Just in time for the 30th annual BMO Magnificent Mile Lights Festival weekend. This is our official grand opening weekend, and the Mag Mile Light Festival is back as well. So this is a huge weekend, not just for us, but all of the city of Chicago. We're very, very excited. That's the sentiment for businesses right now. DeBevix was slated to open April 2020 during the pandemic. Now with the parade, everyone's ready. For us, it's a special. When our children were growing up, we always were down here at the parade. At the Mag Mile, we are Chicagoans and we just love it. We are looking forward to seeing it this year. Mickey Mouse, can't wait to see him. <laughs> Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse are the Grand Marshals and the parade's return is a bright spot. During the pandemic, some businesses were forced to close, but today a special guest. Santa. Delivered a state proclamation, the Welcome governor proclaiming the parade's return, thanks in part to a $400,000 state grant. We aren't just welcoming Chicagoans back to this beloved tradition, we're inviting the world back to the Magnificent Mile. Ultimately, the Magnificent Mile Association wants this weekend to be a financial boost similar to before the pandemic. In 2019, more than 10,000 hotel rooms were booked during the Lights Festival weekend. Business sales hit $26 million and 16,000 employees were busy working. DeBevix is ready. We are ready to, I guess, open the curtains and get the show started. So the businesses are ready. All the fun starts Friday with the tree lighting ceremony here at the Wrigley Building. And then on Saturday, all kinds of family activities that's followed by the parade. It steps off at 5.30. Along the Mag Mile, Stacey Baca, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Okay, Stacey, thank you. And if you can't make it out, you can watch a broadcast of the parade this Sunday at 6 p.m. right here on ABC7. And you can catch the rebroadcast on December 11th and on Christmas morning. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.